YouTube. Your boy is back once again with another dating and relationships video. Okay, so the subject today is when a female says, where is this going? When you're dating a female and she says, where is this going? What is that all about? Right now, so it's within female's nature to settle down with a guy, you know, bear his children, you know, the guy that she wants, she wants to reproduce his genes, have his offspring, yeah, right? So that is the whole intention, yeah? So forget about, you know, all these days, social media, whatever. Forget about the modern day, yeah? From the caveman days, it is nature for females to settle down with a guy. Obviously, all this other stuff is stuff that has evolved with time, yeah? Right, now, so, females, yeah, in my opinion, respect their time way more than the average man respects his time, yeah? So I want you to, I want you guys to start respecting your time. A female, if, if she is messing or dating the guy that she's not going to be, ha going to be having his children, for her, it's a waste of time. That's why she says, where is this going? Because, you know, you, you have some women that are promiscuous, whether they're promiscuous or not, yeah? In their eyes, they don't, they don't have time to waste with a guy if this is not the guy she's going to settle down with. Because that's, that's within her nature. That's, you know, that's her purpose, to find the guy to, you know, a good enough, a good enough guy to, you know, reproduce his genes, his offspring. And if you're not going to be that guy... Sometimes if the guy, you know, has a lot of status or is sexy or whatever, or gives her a lot of money, she will tolerate it more if she doesn't feel it's going nowhere. Because you have other things that she's interested in. But if you're just a mid-level guy, you're good enough for her to date. You're good enough for her to sex. You're even good enough for her to have as a long-term partner. You just made it. You're just about good enough. You know what? This guy is serious. This guy, you know, he's got ambition. You know, he meets my minimum attraction level. So you're not Drake. You're not Trey Songs. Yeah. You're not Idris Elba. You're not, you're not some high status man, but you're good enough for her. But then time goes on and you're not going to that next level. You're not talking about moving. You're not talking about having kids. You're not talking about getting married. She's like, well, this guy might not be the one. Why mess around with you? So you're good enough. If you're going to settle down with her and take her seriously, you're good enough for that. But if you're not no basketball player, football player, some big rapper, why is she messing about with you if it's not going to be long term? She will let the she will let the guys that she sees as 10 out of 10 string her along for a bit. Not forever, but string her along for longer. Yeah. All the excitement, all the handbags, all the whatever. The money, the dates, the charisma. She will let them guys there string her on for a bit longer. But I'd say the average woman respects her time more than the average man. And gents, you need to start respecting your time more. So what do you do when she says, where is this going? Yeah. So whether you're a guy, yeah, that, you know, wants to find the right woman, but you, you don't want to rush into it. Or you're gen generally just a guy who just wants to sleep with women and date women or whatever. Whether it's one woman at a time or multiple women at a time. You just say to her that you're not ready. You're not ready to take it to the next level. Now, she's either going to accept it or not. I'm not going to make this complicated. She's either going to accept it or not. If she doesn't accept it, she can go. Women normally end relationships most of that most of the time. Four out of five times that a relationship is ended is because of a female. Four out of five times a female is going to end a relationship first. So even if she even if she doesn't end a relationship based on this conversation, she could possibly end a relationship down the line. Don't be afraid of losing women. I don't want to go into too much details, yeah. I do not want to, you know, branch off into other subjects. 
I just want to say plain and simple, women, in my humble opinion, on average, respect their time more than men. Now, you need to respect your time, yeah? You might not be ready for a relationship. And you guys are letting girls, you know, make you take them on multiple dates. All you want is a sex, but you've got to do multiple dates, multiple spending, multiple hours on the phone before even speaking to them. And that's your time. She's talking about you. She's talking about men wasting her time. She don't want you to waste her time because... She might be cool not to settle down now and to get with a guy who, who wants to reproduce her kids. But if you're going to be, if you're seeing each other exclusively, then she wants to know where it's going. Does that make sense? So maybe she, maybe she thinks she's got time left on her, on her biological clock. But because you, you, you lot have now clicked and she thinks, okay, this is the guy. But then down the line, you know, you take long to introduce her to your family and all that. You know, you know the lingo. If you've been in a relationship or nearly in a relationship, you know, you know, you know how it goes. So, you know, where is this going? Respectful, polite, you just like, you know what, really like you, da 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 da, -da But I'm not ready to settle down yet. Regardless if you're a guy that, if you genuinely want to, if you genuinely want to see how it's going, or you're just a guy who wants to sleep around because... You might be a guy who just wants to sleep around with women, but down the line, you because it, it's it's not even lying because down the line you may feel like okay, I don't want to do this dating, sleeping around thing no more. I want to settle down with this girl. So you're not actually lying when you're telling that. I want I want to just see how it goes. But gents, believe me when I tell you, she might end it, and that's when you have to take it on the chin and take the L. Because you're not going to let a woman force you into a relationship that you don't want to be in. Trust me, I'm not going to go into detail on this video. But you don't want a woman to force you into a relationship that you're not ready to be in. Maybe it's because you're not ready to be in a long-term relationship. Full stop. Or maybe this is the type of girl that she's good enough to have sexual activities with. But you don't see her as a long-term girlfriend or wifey. Or a, a lady that, um, you know, that you want to have children with. So, again, I'm going to say it one more time. If she tells you where where's this going and in your mind you're not ready for whatever reason, you want to give it more time or you genuinely don't just see her as a girl that you want to settle down with, just tell her, look, at this particular time, look, I like you, I like spending time with you, but I'm not ready. If she wants to done what you have there and then, take it on the chin. You know, don't be rude. Don't do no mad thing. Don't do no block thing. You know she might come to her senses tomorrow, or she might be, you know, she might be um, playing it, um, just playing to see how you're gonna react to it or whatever. Don't block it. Just cool. You know what? I respect you. Like, just keep it respectful. She might come back and said, "Okay, you, you know what? It's fine. We could just, we could just do the sexual only thing, whatever, whatever." So you're not gonna get all upset and block her or whatever. Like, you just okay. You just accept it. You know, a lot of but. I get it. A lot of you men are going to be in a scarcity mindset because you don't get a lot of women and whatever. So when she throws that on you, where's it's going? You don't want to lose what you have with her. So you, so you don't, you're not relationship minded or you're not ready for that yet. But because of the scarcity mindset, you know what? Look, let me commit to this girl the way she wants me to commit to her because I don't know when I'm going to get another girl. You not. you might not be thinking that in the forefront of your mind, but it's a subconscious thing. Only... The only settle down when you are ready like the, the world ain't ending tomorrow if she wants you to commit to her and you are not ready to say to her look i'm not ready for this yet if based on that she says well i don't think i can continue with this you know what i respect your opinion you know what like obviously just respectfully go your own way she might come back she might not and if she does that, you're free to speak to other women straight away. If she's calling your bluff, she's calling your bluff. She 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 will contact you back. And it's plain. And yeah, I'm I'm oversimplifying it because obviously, you know, you might catch feelings for the girl. So in your mind, I don't want to settle down. But oh my god, this girl is so good. Or I've never got a girl this good before. Or a girl has never given me this kind of amazing sex before. I get it. I get it. But for for guys that don't get a lot of girl, I get it. Yeah. Even for guys that get. A moderate amount of girls, not just for guys that are in a, you know, a drought or whatever, generally speaking, but even average guys, I get it. But don't let these women bully you. They will tell you that when women, I can't believe, women tell you that you're wasting their time. 
What about your time? What about your time? What about all the times you took you, you, you took her on dates? Forget the money part because everyone's at a different financial level. Some for some guys is nothing like spending money. So forget the money part because time is way more valuable than money. What about your time? All the times you took her on dates. All the times you spoke to her on the phone. Yeah, the times that you spoke to her on the phone, that's her time as well. But remember, females like men's company. They value attention from men. Unless you, until you get really um, acquainted with a girl, you don't actually want them for their time. You you want sex, yeah, yeah. When you once you build, you know, once you build a connection with them, you know, you, you might enjoy spending time with them. They might have a good personality or whatever. But at the beginning, you you just really want sex. Come on, come on, gents. You just really want sex. So what about your time? So so she's saying you're wasting her time because. You know, if this is not going anywhere, because obviously it's within the nature to, you know, settle down with a guy, um, reproduce, have kids or whatever. And for men, men just generally speaking, men just want to conquer and bang, and bang everything. You know, some men are brainwashing to thinking that they actually want to be with one woman. But a lot of men, especially at a younger age, obviously when you get older, you know, you've you've had all the women you want and you want to settle down, you want to build a family or whatever and then create a legacy. Cool. Yeah, that's later on in life. Or whatever, yeah. But men want to conquer. So you, so you want to sleep with this woman. Bringing it back to the beginning, you want to sleep with this woman, but you had to take her on date upon date before you even first met her. You know all these WhatsApp messages, yeah, all these Instagram DMs, all these hours on our our phone call. The next day, our phone call. Obviously, I know it's not all like that. Some some girls you sleep with on the first night. I get that, but a lot of times. You have to put in so much time and effort when all you want is sex. Yeah, it might be a girl that you start properly feeling afterwards and you get into a proper relationship with them. But what about your time? What about your time? What about your time? Yeah. So when a female says, where is this going? Just think for a second. So she's saying that because what she's saying is wife me up. Not literally married, but well, maybe in the future, but wife me up make us exclusive make us a proper thing or get out of my life that's what she's saying when she's saying where is this going just think for a second do i want this to be my exclusive chick do i see her as you know someone i have kids with or whatever settling down you know it's me and her exclusive do i see her as that or not and if i do see her as that am i ready or not if the answer to any of them is no then say to her i'm not ready for this respectfully if she parts if she parts ways with you she parts ways you're on to the next one or you might be seeing other girls anyway but i think i got my point across in this particular video catch me in the next video dating a relationship your boy is gone